So some possible examples of these log normal distributions are some things that you might actually be quite familiar with. You know, log normal, it sounds a little bit complex. It sounds a little scary, perhaps. We haven't really covered it in class. But log normal distributions describe things as common to us as Facebook posts. You know, nobody really posts one word. Um, normally, it's like a few words, perhaps a sentence, occasionally a paragraph, and occasionally a book. So <clears throat> they just could continually be very large, but those aren't very frequent. But they're also pretty much never going to be one sentence or one letter. So some other examples are some mammalian teeth, for instance. You know, no mammals have no teeth. And there are mammals who have very large teeth, walruses. But <clears throat> um, most of the time, it's going to be focused and distributed in a zone of teeth length. The same with like extreme weather days. You know, we're probably going to have an extreme weather day or two occasionally throughout the year. And we could have quite a few, but mostly it's going to be focused in the middle. The same with city size and with length of chess games, as it turns out. Um, you know, cities, there's, for instance, around 18,000 cities in the U.S. Um, those there's New York, who's 1.8 billion, I think. No, million. Um, and then there's cities as small as like 500. So, yeah. Those are some examples. Same with chess games. Some people take forever to play chess. But some experts are very, very quick. So, thank you for letting me join you from afar. And hope you guys are all having an extra week. And enjoy the rest of our presentation.